Hey guys, how's it going? And welcome back to the Tavern. I don't know if you guys know what this is, so hit that subscribe button while you're there. And also, this is the brown bag review, okay? It's the only bag that we could buy that completely covers it up from the gas station or the liquor store. They get to choose. I let random people choose. Today, Pretty Lady chose. She chose two drinks for me to mix together. And we're going to see what those are and whether or not they will mix. All right, so we have our glass here. She did tell me they were two malt beverages, so I did get a bigger glass. Okay. We have the Sex on the Beach Pirate Water, 10%. We reviewed these a few weeks ago. They were actually pretty good. So, number two. Okay, so she went with the same company, Brown Water, but this one's Brown what Mount uh, Pirate Water, if I can get the words right. Bahama Mama. All right, so we have the Bahama Mama and the Sex on the Beach, and they're going in. Both of these... Both of these are 10% alcohol, okay? So we're going to start with the Bahama Mama. It's storming here, so hopefully you guys don't get affected by the everything. About half seas. We're going to do the same with this one. One orange, one pinkish red. Boom. Let's get those out there for you. It looks more orange now. Oh, oh, oh. That smells extremely malty. Wow. That smells crazy malty. Let's try it. Okay. Actually, it doesn't taste malty at all. It's really crazy because the Bahama Mama and the Sex on the Beach were two of the drinks that I couldn't really pinpoint a specific flavor because it was so wildly vibrant across both of them wow definitely kind of like a strawberry mango maybe maybe a little peachy and the thunder rolls and the lightning strikes it kind of has this weird um kind of ashy aftertaste too kind of like cigarette ash which is weird like a wood ash, tobacco ash. Mm. A little sticky. Dry. Really dry on the back. But not a bad combination at all. But guys, these will mess you up. The last two times we did these videos, I drank... I downed two of these in eight minutes, and it was rough. I'm telling you, it was rough. A malt drunk hits way harder than a liquor drunk. <sighs> That's good. Um, <clears throat> even finishing it out like that, again, the only downside is it's super, super dry on the back of the palate. Um, it feels like it builds up a lot, like right here. Overall, I don't know. Maybe I'm just biased by the pirate water, but pirate water, all four of them that I tried were really good. So very worth trying them. They're not bad priced. Overall, 10 out of 10. I love it, guys. Hit that like button, comment, subscribe. Remember, I buy it so you guys don't have to. I try it so you guys don't have to. Will it mix? Yes, it does will so guys till next time tomorrow in the brand new live stream we're gonna be playing some video games but till then y'all have a blessed day have a great one but because remember i'm justin and welcome to the tavern and we grow every single day with me numbers or knowledge you guys are absolutely amazing and i'll see you guys next